George Washington Brush, October 4, 1842, November 18, 1927, was an American soldier, dentist, physician and politician. He served as a captain of a black company in the 34th Infantry Regiment U.S. Colored Troops in the Union Army during the American Civil War and received the Medal of Honor. After the war he became first a dentist and then a physician. He was elected to the New York State Assembly and then the State Senate. As chairman of the Senate Health Committee he helped establish the State Tuberculosis Sanatorium at Saranac Lake. Early life and education Brush was born in West Hills, Huntington, New York in 1842. He was born in the family farmhouse that is still standing and occupied today. He left to live in Brooklyn at the age of 17. He worked in a dry goods store for $2 per week. Two years later when the Civil War began he was among the first to volunteer. Career Civil War on August 13. 1861 George joined the 48th New York Regiment as a private and fought at the capture of Fort Walker and Fort Beauregard. On June 6, 1863 he was promoted to second lieutenant and volunteered to serve with the newly formed 34th USCT Infantry Regiment made up of black slaves from South Carolina. He was among the first group of white officers to command a unit of all black troops. By 1865 he was a captain commanding a full company of the 34th Regiment. After the war, Brush became a companion of the Massachusetts Commandery of the Military Order of the Loyal Legion of the United States. He was also a compatriot of the Empire State Society of the Sons of the American Revolution. Medal of Honor The 34th Infantry Regiment was ordered on May 24, 1864 on an expedition to Ashiepa River, South Carolina to burn a railroad trestle across a marsh at that point. About 400 members of the Black Regiment were loaded onto the troop steamer Boston, including 1st Lieutenant George W. Brush and the men of his company. The men had been ferried out to the Boston by small boats and one was fastened to the ship's stern. Sailing down the Ashiepa River in fog and darkness the ship became stranded upon an oyster bed. The Confederates planted a battery of guns on the river bank and began shelling the Boston. Lieutenant Brush quickly assembled four volunteers and began transporting men from the Boston to shore with the one small boat available. His Medal of Honor citation reads as follows, Voluntarily commanded a boat crew, which went to the rescue of a large number of Union soldiers on board the stranded steamer Boston, and with great gallantry succeeded in conveying them to shore, being exposed during the entire time to heavy fire from a Confederate battery. Instrumental in attaining the Medal of Honor for Lieutenant Brush were the efforts of the unit's chaplain Homer W. Moore. Dentist and physician after the war Brush returned to Brooklyn and became a dentist. After several years as a dentist he entered Long Island College Hospital Medical School from which he graduated in 1876. He had a long and successful medical practice in Brooklyn. State legislator Dr. Brush was very active in Brooklyn civic and political affairs. He was a member of the New York State Assembly, King's Company, 7th D. In 1895, and a member of the New York State Senate, 4th D. From 1896 to 1898, sitting in the 119th, 120th, and 121st New York State legislatures. He was chairman of the Senate Health Committee and helped to establish the NY State Tuberculosis Sanitarium at Saranac Lake. He was also a member of the Sons of the American Revolution and the Military Order of the Loyal Legion of the United States. Personal life Brush had married Alice Bowers in Huntington in 1865 while home on leave. Alice sailed from New York to Florida to join Brush seven weeks after the wedding. The steamship was caught in a storm off Cape Hatteras and sank with all on board being lost. In 1868 Brush married Marie Bowers, Alice's younger sister. They were married for 58 years and had one child, a son named Herbert. Death Dr. Brush died on November 16, 1927 and is buried in the Huntington Rural Cemetery in Suffolk County in Long Island, New York. See also List of Medal of Honor recipients Notes 
References. Civil War, A.L. Brush, George W. Entry. Medal of Honor Recipients. United States Army Center of Military History. August 6, 2009. Retrieved July 13, 2010. Bayer, W.F. and Keto, O. F. Deeds of Valor. How America's Civil War Heroes Won the Congressional Medal of Honor. Stamford C.T. Long Meadow Press, 1994. Brush, Maria Nett Bowers. Brush Bowers Genealogy, Brooklyn, N.Y., 1904 Man, Conklin, Thomas and Richard Brush of Huntington, N.Y. The New York Genealogical and Biographical Society Record, Volumes, LXVI and LXVII, Less Than 1935-1936, U.S. Colored Troops Organized in South Carolina, 34th U.S.C. Infantry, Web. The 12th of April 2010. HTTP colon slash slash SCUSCT.org. Congressional Medal of Honor Recipients. The Congressional Medal of Honor Society. Web. The 10th of April. 2010.http. www.cmos.org. External links. George W. Brush. Claim to Fame. Medal of Honor Recipients. Find a Grave. Retrieved May 19th. 2010. Brushes in the American Civil War. Archived from the original on July 17, 2011. Retrieved September 29, 2010.